I have a really quick video here today on this hair. This is on Boo hair. I'm going to get into the specifications in a minute, but I just wanted to say I apologize for not wearing any makeup. I'm just going natural today. I just feel like uh, feeling really beachy and summery and I'm ready for the summer to get here so I can rock this hair on the beach and be like, oh yeah. So yeah, enjoy, bye. I'm wearing uh, an 18 inch frontal that's been custom cut, uh, layers around my face. I'm wearing four bundles of 26 or three bundles of 26. I'll make sure I put an annotation up on the screen. This was a custom wig. It um, was actually sent to me by Andy Boo Hair uh, after, of course, after me purchasing it. But I purchased the hair in a sale that she was doing with the wigs that she was wearing, with the wigs that she was using for her promotional work. So I purchased this wig. This was, uh, it did come in a discount because it was already pre-worn, of course. However, uh, and it was a pre-made wig. Now, I have, if you guys haven't been following me for a long time, I know there's like three of you that have, but whatever. Uh, I actually have a massive head. And I actually have to get my stuff custom made. But I started actually making my own wigs. So I do make my own wigs. I've been making my wigs for about a year and a half now. I used to go to Hair He Goes on Instagram. However, I have then moved on to... Don't get me wrong, I still love Darnell. But I did move on to doing my own hair. So every wig that you've seen me in since has been my own work. I did do the roots on this. This did not come like this. I did the like the softest root possible because I wanted it to be super beachy. Now this is not the curl pattern that you get directly after washing it because I haven't washed it since Sunday and it's now Thursday. So this is good hair. I have a couple of qualms with it. The only thing that I get here is a little bit of tangling in the back. This is my first curly hair, you guys. I've never worn, well, not curly, wavy. I've never worn a pattern like this before because it's raw Indian hair. So this has never been processed. It's just obviously been lightened to this color. But look at this. In the back, this is what you get after washing it. This beautiful wave here. But during the week after washing it, I like to have like Topanga from Boy Meets World when she was younger, that kind of 90s flip in the front. I've been wearing it in a middle part this week, kind of. I just really love this hair. And the only other qualm that I kind of have with it is that the frontal is a bit of a looser curl than the back. You can see the curl pattern here. This is perfect example of the curl pattern. But as you can see, the frontal is a bit straighter. I also wanted to mention too that this is the first frontal I've ever had or wig or anything that has flawlessly matched my complexion. This is um, pretty much see-through, honestly. So you're gonna see whatever cap you put under it. It's amazing. I am obsessed with on, on debut hair. Uh, many of you guys know if you follow me on Instagram or if you follow me, I'll leave the links in the description or if you follow me anywhere else, that, that Andy Boo hair is pretty much my favorite so far. I've never come in contact with anything better, honestly. Um, also, I wanted to mention that this hair has been toned. I did use my shimmer lights. I've used countless purple shampoos and blue shampoos, and I prefer shimmer lights by Clairol. I can't remember who it's by, but I do absolutely love that product to make your hair this kind of natural white, okay? So I just honestly am obsessed with this hair. I can't get over it. The amount of compliments I get and people are like, oh my God, is that your natural hair? I'm like, yeah, it is, yeah, it is, yeah, yeah. This is my natural hair. I was sent in the wig that was already made, I ordered um, a frontal and 326 inches because I actually had, and I knew I wanted to add another bundle just for shits, but I'll show, the, I'll show it when it just had three bundles. Hey. 
and then this is obviously of course uh that that was actually that photo that i just shown that was uh the same day of washing but i added one more bundle just for that you know kind of and it's the same it's on debut hair it's a bundle of 30 inches that i cut into 26 and i love this it comes just under my breasts and i just feel like so beachy and so sexy and i love this hair and it's so bedroom like i just woke up like this for a while i was rocking hair that was all one length so this frontal would have been like down here and then all this hair would have been like you know like really kind of blunt towards the ends but i think i'm more of a layers girl honestly i just think i like the i like the look it gives me the look it gives me so yeah honestly let me get up here and show you the texture See that? You see this texture? Stunning. Absolutely stunning. The frontal, all the only thing I do to it, when it's wet, I put the frontal in one big braid, take it out, matches. Done. So yeah, once again, Andy Boo gets only because of the tangling in the back that is kind of a user error. So I'm not going to mark them wrong on that. They get two thumbs up. You know, Andibu will always have two thumbs up for me. And their owner, Andibu's owner, is stunning and beautiful and amazing. She's beautiful inside and out. And she holds it down for me and her other customers. So honestly, I really just wanted to give props to the company just being a really fucking kick-ass company honestly uh yeah i hope you guys like my hair if you don't like my hair i don't care so yeah talk to you guys later and bye